Wait, what? Hey, I. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is the Britannian, and welcome to Hunt the Turkey. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, the Bork Arg. Three is well and truly upon us, and it has brought these little fellows with them. The assimilated Ferengi traders, which are available in every single Borg system from level 25 all the way up to level 33. We affectionately call them the Borg turkeys. Um, they are available basically, they spawn in very, very randomly. I've been very lucky. I've actually I've actually managed to snag myself nine so far. And the way in which I do it is actually very simple. Uh, I've managed to unlock, so I've got visibility of all of the Borg systems. Now, if you don't have visibility, ask some of the members of your alliance to give you a hand with this. Um, most people will be very happy to help. Scan the individual Borg systems. And what you need to do is then fly your ship, not to the actual system itself, but fly it into the independent system just before you enter Borg space. Now, there's a reason for doing this. If you fly to the independent system and keep tracking the Borg on your screen, as you can see I'm doing at the moment, I've got one minute and 30 seconds until I land, you can actually make sure that you don't waste a transwarp cell. So that means you're only actually going into the system and spending that cell at the very, very, very last second. That means if the Ferengi traded these spawns, or someone else gets it, then you haven't actually lost anything. It does take a little bit of time, does take a lot of luck, and it will mean that your alliance should be working as a whole together. Now on my screen, you'll see that's my rewards there for level seven. This was taken back when I didn't actually have any. I do actually have nine now, and right at the very, very end of the video, you'll actually see what I managed to get. And I'm really excited what I managed to get out of my uh, pull today. Um, so that's going to be shown in the next video, exactly what that is. Um, so, yeah, that's basically it. Those are my tips. If you don't know what crew to use, I suggest the cadet crew with Talan. Uh, or Chen, depending on, you know, how you, how you actually, uh, what levels they are. Uh, if you don't know what the cadet crew are, go down to uh, one of the videos on YouTube that are linked below, one of the channels. There's no one shall, there is RevJuice, there is Starquip linked down below in my descriptions. They all have some excellent videos on what crews to use for hunting various things. Um, as I said, the cadet crew for these, and that's what we all recommend at the moment, uh, if you don't have Pike and Moreau, of course. Talking of which, that's going to be one of the next videos coming up, is alternatives to Pike and Moreau. And uh, my name is The Britannian. I'm going to leave you just for now. There's uh, some log files in the background there. A few other little bits of uh, play. And uh, stay tuned right to the very, very end of the video for uh, the results of my pull, which are actually after the stinger. And uh, I'll catch you guys uh, over on Discord or on Twitch. So you can get me. My name is The Britannian. And I'll catch you again very, very soon. See ya. Thank you.